Magu Zian Sho, divine marijuana brings immortality. I mean, look at me. All you healthy people falling apart. You know how many healthy people I met and then fell apart? Shit coming out the bottom of their foot. Oh, I don't smoke that herb. I'm still here, libations to the ancestors. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hamada, hamada, hamada. So, this is the whole point at this point of me making the videos that I'm making at this point. You know, I'm getting used to um, talking to a computer. So, um, it seems that we have to adjust to what is considered the future. Like my whole thing as you know, if you look at my videos or some of them, you know, is about Actually, you know, I'm, I'm, I want to start a movement called the Black, Black without a C, because you don't need a C if you got a K. Anyway, the Black to the Land movement. So, I am a man. I have a plan, like for the last, all my life. So I'm a man, I have a plan, and guess what? I purchased some land. You can see videos. And it's like, all I need is a clan. Now, when I say a clan, I don't need no followers, no believers, and there aren't no leaders. So no believers and no followers. Please. This is not about following me. You don't want to follow me because you end up with no teethers. And so you don't want to follow me. What you want to do is do for yourself. 
but in order to do for yourself in this day and time, at least the way, again, I'm an individual, so the way I, I can imagine doing for yourself in this day and time, in my mind, is that we need our own space, dude. We need our own space. You know, when, when you be like, yo, dude, I need my space, dude. What are you saying? You know, if you're in an apartment like this and, and you got a mate or you got a friend or somebody that's just like your business or whatever, and you be like, I need my space. Well, wait a minute. This, this space that I'm in right now is like damn near $2,000 a month, a month, a month. And it's like, okay, living room, kitchen, bedroom, which somebody's renting, bathroom, living room and bedroom, bathroom, a little tiny porch, you know what I'm saying? Two thousand, well, sixteen hundred dollars a month, right? So, now I also have property like an hour and a half, literally, like if I was driving an hour and a half away from here. And if I just had a room here, like her, what I'm paying for, what she's paying for the room here, I'm paying for five and an eighth acres of land. I'll, I'll be quiet for a second so you can think about that. Well, this, this, this counts as an eighth. This be like an acre and this be like an eighth. So there's like five acres in the eighth. So to give you an idea what that means is one acre, an acre is about the size of a football field. Look it up on, the, look it up on your, this thing of Madrid, your laptop. It's about an acre of land without the end. I mean, it's about a football field, but without the end zones. That's an acre. I have five of those. Let's forget about the eighth. I have five acres. Well, I'm gonna go into the details of, of the plan of what you, because you average, the average person, those of you who live in cities and don't even realize that you can buy land, don't even realize that there is land to be bought. You know, you might see these um, commercials and stuff, oh, flip this or resell that, da, da. I'm not talking about that. I am not talking about, I'm talking about get land and own that land and use that land and live on that land. Why are you begging and struggling day after day after day to pay $1,600 to live in something like this? You understand? Um, I'm making these videos right now because I'm getting ready to go or re-move back to my land because I've already moved my stuff out there but I had to come back to the city. Blah, 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 blah. But I'm, hopefully this week, I'm out. And when I get out there, oh my good loadedness, a good lord. <laughs> Space. The final frontier space. No sisters, no, no sisters walking around like.
No brothers like. Not none, zip, zero, not a. That's what time it is. I'm like, I'm not, I'm not preaching no holiness, but there still have to be some type of order. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I don't give a, I don't give a what you believe. So I'm gonna be making an offer to people to come out to the land. Let's get some stuff started. Let's grow our own food. Let's grow our own stuff. Let's make our own stuff. Let's go back to the land. Now, I am not saying let's go back to the land and then be like the Quakers where we don't have no technology and stuff. It's about balance. The technology is off the chain. We can make everything we need with the technology, but we can't let it rule our lives either. We have to be a part of nature. I am not going all the way. I'm not putting shit in my body unless I need it. That's where the balance comes in. If I'm blind, well, I might get a robotic eye. If I'm not blind, if I know how to heal my body, I don't need no stinking technology in my hand, in my brain, in my body. But we can use it just like I'm using this technology right now. Right now. Balance. I'm out. Proof B. Hey.